tonight with you all? Oh, it, it wasn't easy at all. I mean, uh, Brighton can have a great, great team, you know. Uh, they were there the whole time. And I just think we did a great job smashing the, in the last three quarters. What happened in that first quarter when you guys gave up 41 points? Yeah, I mean, it was just a really bad start, you know. Uh, we weren't together in this game, we didn't play defense, so it was a really bad start, and then, then we picked it up. Tell us about that long three-corner that you banked in and put you up seven a little over a minute ago. I was lucky. <laughs> you say. But you know, uh, you know, everybody knows I love those plays uh, at the end of the game, and just we'll take the responsibility. So what happened in the second quarter? How, got, how were you guys able to pull things together? I think we just support each other, you know. Uh, we had a best start. We had a best start in the first night, too, you know. Not that kind of bad start, but it was a bad start. And we just kept playing together, uh, especially get tough on our defense and just try to play out of stops. Luca, how about holding your composure at the end of the game? You're up 10 in the quarter. They get it down to two. Obviously, you make two huge plays, but you never let them get in front, which is something, obviously, a lot of times last year that didn't happen. Yeah, I mean, it's important, you know. Uh, like I said, it's, it's defense, you know. Uh, uh, there's a lot of players that have a lot of talent. Uh, they're gonna score. They're gonna score uh, unless you like it or not. They're gonna score. When they come back. You know, just just go right at them. Uh, just right back. How about the play of the lot tonight? Oh, it was amazing. Uh, he played amazing game. You know, uh, he's that kind of player. He's gonna play like this, and he was just uh, he was he was the key to our win. This team is two and up for the first time in 15 years. Just talk about what that means to you guys. It means a lot, you know. Uh, everybody's happy after this win. Uh, but, you know, just to start, uh, you got to keep going and hopefully, like I said, like I say, every time make the playoffs. They kept coming in there. Yeah, no, I was just I was trying to protect the rim, you know. That's, that's something I love to do. And and uh, tonight I was able to help my teammates down there. And, and at the end, we got the win, so I'm happy. Is the How defense kind of set, them, set up to, to send people at you, and, and that's your job? I think I think guys did a really good job of um, running shooters off the off the line, and 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 that made them drive drive towards me. And you know, I was there, and I was I was trying to do my best for, to protect the rim. And that's it. How did you guys turn this around up being down 14 and giving up 41 points in the first quarter? Yeah. Um, we wanted to, as soon as I got back in the game, I, I, you know, I told everybody we want to step it up, step, we want to step it up, we want to um, put it in a, in, a, in a different gear defensively. And we got out there with more energy, with more intensity, uh, more vocal, and, and that got our energy on defense up. Got a few stops, and that, that got us going into the game. And, and um, we try to keep that, that high energy throughout the game. It worked for us. What can you say about Luca? Another triple double and that long bank shot from three point land puts you up seven. Right? He, he makes those shots. It's wild. At the end of the game, you know, Luca's very clutch and, and um, he gave us two crucial baskets at the end there. So, uh, great win. When, when, he's, when he's working like that offensively, how much more does that open up things or, or, or other guys and it makes it makes the offense flow a little bit? Yeah, definitely. No, he was uh, he was maybe probably like. Beginning of the beginning of the game, but earlier in the game, he was he was creating a lot. You know, he was driving, kicking the ball out for open shots and stuff, and he got ten assists. You know, uh, and then at the end, took two uh, very important possessions and 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 get us a he got us a bucket, and that's what he does. Rick said you were just gassed at the end. Is that what happened? No. <laughs> also, some great defense by Delon and Seth Curry there in the fourth quarter. Let's talk about that performance. Uh, sorry, who? Delon and. and uh, yeah, Delon played great. Delon played great. Seth, Seth came in, made huge, huge shots for me. Played great defense, both guys. Delon, you know, had his best game so far, and that just shows what he's what he's capable of doing. So, uh, everybody stepped up today. Got a great win on the road. I'm happy. What did you feel about the composure that your team showed when they you know, when they made the ones at you at the like the end of the third, you were ten and they cut to yeah. two, and then you're at eleven, and uh, you know they get it down to within two, yeah. but, you, but they never were able to get in front of you. Yeah. Yeah, nobody, nobody really like panicked. You know, we just kept playing our games. You know, we knew they were going to make their runs, and and they're an aggressive team defensively. You know, they always got their hands in there, and and, and they got a lot of um, uh, deflections and stuff, and and that's how they get going again. And, and we we stayed we stayed uh, uh, stayed uh, patient with the whole situation. We we we, we, didn't, we didn't we didn't panic, and we just played our game. You know, to uh, try to bring that same intensity on on the defensive end and offensively. I felt like. You know, we have a lot of weapons and we're able to just score able, more baskets than that. To be able to finish the game the way you guys finished the game. You know, with, you, you, 
stop you scored, but you got the stops. That you exactly, made. yeah, exactly. As, as, as I said, you know, everybody stepped up defensively also. Um, I think we, we made a step forward today as, as a team, you know, and, and we're just we're just starting to build right now. So I'm excited for our future. The are you Mavs surprised up. to hear that the Mavs are 2-0 and for the first time since 2004-2005? Oh, wow, that's, that's crazy. Uh, but yeah. It is what it is. We got two wins. We got 80 more games. <laughs> so <laughs> on to the next one. All right. Uh, Lucas scoring eight points in the last five minutes. How much of that is, is by design, and how much of it is just kind of him creating yeah. what he can in, in a big moment? Yeah. No, that's that's him. He's the main um, ball handler for us. Um, you know, he loves those moments. Uh, I love those moments. You know, and and, and we're gonna we're gonna. We're gonna try to be dangerous there at the end, and you know when Luca, when, Lu when the ball's in Luca's hands, he can make whatever happen, you know, and, and, and that's what he does. So we'll keep uh, we'll keep uh, um, putting uh, confidence in him in those moments. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus.